you. Uh, my name is Walter Delze, and I'm giving you my NoFap journey, my NoFap journal. Today, day 63. Very awesome. Today was like very chill day that ended with like a very fucking awesome conversation man I'm making this video in my garden and it's a little bit cold I'm not having coma but my body has having some coldness so where should I begin? <coughs> yeah, I'm... This is just me going in my heart chakra. So, the thing is, I had a very chill day. Like, the weird thing was, I kinda had like this inner child's how do you say that? Connection. I connect with my inner child. Like I felt like I was 16 again. Like 15, 16 again. And in that period of my life, I was experiencing, experience, experiencing these, yeah, like I had like, these nice experiences with girls and yeah I just felt the same man like this just like this inner confidence just this very chilled vibe and this thing of I love women and I can attract almost any girl I want from a place of love Maybe this sounds kind of ego, ego-ish, but yeah, whatever. So, yeah, the thing is, <coughs> it was very, very chill. I went to the, to the cinema with my friends. We went to Star Wars, the Han Solo movie. If you didn't watch it already, like, Tell me in the comments what you thought about the movie, but for me the movie was very neutral. <laughs> yeah, it was very neutral. In fact, like it was like almost like training me to be in the now, man. Like very focused on the now instead of like really watching the movie. But the nice part about the movie, in my opinion, was Dormo. Fucking dark mole man. This guy is fucking nice. Like at first I was like, why is he so old? But then yeah everything made sense. He's from episode one and this is like between I think episode three and four I guess. So my body. So yeah that's it was just a relaxed day. Me and my friends went into the forest and just chilled. We laughed a little, we laughed very much. We connected on our humor. Yeah, we just had these nice expressions of just being being happy, man. Like I had this rule that I that I couldn't be happy when I was feeling this. Now I. I still have this chakra and balance, but I can't be happy, man. Even though it's sometimes maybe a little bit difficult to express myself, but hey. So the nicest thing about this, like I learned 
much today. Like, I'm very aware of my ego. I could say like your ego lives where like your solar plexus is. I can, f I feel like this is where he, his residence is, his physical residence, because everything that is not love, every emotion that's not love, is is the ego like happiness, all those high emotions are who you truly are and the other emotions are ego that's not bad, but it's just it's what it is and I felt like <laughs> my friend said something, like I almost cried during the movie I just thought it was like a nice scene, that's my thing, that love sequence and I was saying to him like I have to cry and he said act normal man and now I, I immediately felt that my ego was taking this personal man but the thing is this is so nice it's so a learning curve so I can say I can have like a healthy ego and like I can say now tomorrow from like I can say tomorrow when I see him Hey, hey, like, my ego felt a little bit hurt. And that's like setting boundaries. You can say, like, yeah, I was, I was feeling hurt. But I know it's not me, so I decided to say it's my ego because it's the ego. But that's, like, very nice to do, in my opinion, because... I was immediately back focused on the now. And that's very powerful. Like I changed the meaning of what he's saying. He's just saying something. It's my perspective of this guy's perspective of... Yeah, he's just interpreting things like it doesn't have to be negative. If he's saying act normal, it's just saying from his perspective, so that's very nice. But the thing is, what I really want to talk about is, uh, I met up with my, with this friend who's also very conscious, and we had this conversation like two, three hours about every, like this high frequency talk, man. This was, I felt almost back in this enlightenment state, in this neo power state, because yeah, we were just so vibing, man, and just being our true self. It was so nice. I can't even recall what we were re about what we were talking. It just, yeah, went fluently, man, not even thinking. That's, that's just the crazy part. It's like having a conversation where you barely have to think. Everything goes with the flow. That's very nice, man. That's... That's just you being in the present. What we talked about was, <laughs> yeah, much about like the ego, about law of attraction, bettering ourselves, open relationships. It's so nice, man. Yeah. This is it, man. Just a chill thing. Don't have a lot to say now. So, peace.